click, click, the whole deal. My wife and I. Uh, this, the film is called You Must Be Joking. Sass Goldberg plays a mid-twenties girl with a life she hates. That's true. That's like every mid-twenties girl, I right? Know. Okay. That's why we wrote it. And uh, she's living alone in a small apartment, and she works as a paralegal in a job that she rolls her eyes at. I saw the, just the trailer. Uh, she then runs into an old childhood friend, which is Jake Wilson. Yeah. Did you know Jake before you started the movie? We went to college together. So I had yes. a sense. Okay. Yeah. And this is your big project, right? This oh, yeah. Is, this you, is our baby. Did you guys both write it together? We yes. did. Yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, so she, and he says, uh, I'm guessing from the trailer, but just go for your dreams. Yeah. Quit your boring paralegal job. You got it. Uh, and by the way, you have really wonderful stereotypical parents, too. Oh, yes. Movie. I yes. love that. Perfect. <laughs> oh, the fantastic. pressuring mother. Yeah. Uh, the one who's not trying to offend you right. with all her offensive comments about right. you. Of course. Um, anyway, uh, you attempt to turn your lonely, sucky paralegal life into a slightly less sucky life as a comedian. You must be joking screens for the first time anywhere. This is the <laughs> premiere at Pacific Place Cinemas, 7 o'clock. Celebrity red carpet arrivals. That's you two, right? Oh, yeah, we're oh, the yeah, celebs. Huge what time do you celebs. have to be there? 6.30. 630. Yeah. Yeah. So that's uh, how celebs A lot of paparazzi will be there. You got so, a glam squad, <laughs> yeah, obviously. Us Weekly like, is knocking down our door. Uh, <laughs> and I got to say, it's not that often that anybody gets to see a nice, uh, fun comedy movie with the big stars, the star and the and the other star. Yeah. I don't always say co-stars, but co-stars um, at the red carpet ahead of time and know that you're watching it with them for the first time. That that happens frequently in like Los Angeles, right? Maybe New York. Uh, but SIF is a wonderful uh, treasure here in Seattle. So if you're looking for something fun to do tonight, it's uh, it's going to sell out pretty quickly, right? Yeah, oh, yeah. I mean, people are going to be banging down the Get door. Get your ticket, 7 p.m. Go early and eat at one of them uh, nasty restaurants. Johnny Rockets. <laughs> <laughs> I like Johnny <laughs> Rockets. <laughs> you like it, but you haven't eaten Johnny Rockets in a long time. Not in a long time, but Emily loves to go to that theater because uh, you can watch the wait for the line to go mm -hmm. down while you're eating at Johnny Rockets. Get like 8,000 <laughs> calories of Gordon Beer or Johnny Rock. No, cross yeah. over Gordon the bridge and go to Nordstrom Cafe. Oh, yeah. oh now oh. you're talking. Right. You see? Then 6,000 calories of popcorn, and you won't look like these young, beautiful <laughs> no, people, yeah. but you'll have enjoy Stop. yourself. We're on premiere diets, you know, so right. see us next week. <laughs> <Premier> <laughs> <diets>. <laughs> All right, now, I, I read a little. There's not, because you guys have not, you know, done anything uh, crazy, yeah. there's not a lot about you on the internet. Oh, God, what is there? Yeah. yeah pretty much bio stuff. No you know. dirt. Uh, you, uh, creator of the groundbreaking musical web series, The Battery's Down. Yeah. Which I am I'm admitting I, I haven't. What's that about? So it's uh, it's a musical web series about myself trying to make it as an actor. This is like before Glee, before Smash. Mm. You know, it would be like, I'm here at a radio interview at KJR. Wow. Know? Yeah. You sing. Yeah, well, that was a little rough. Oh, he's yeah, better than I, that. I'm much better. You can, do, you can really sing. Oh, I, I got the I sense because you were not shy. <laughs> um, and Sass, yeah. uh, a lot of theater? A lot of theater. Yeah. In New York. I'm a native New Yorker, born and bred. Okay, now, let me say, and Jody's New Jersey, you could tell, right? My husband's you New Jersey. You could smell me over here, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> and I, um, uh, my son is a traveling stand-up comic in his fifth year. So Get he's out. living this life, and he quit a horrible job at a PR firm. I saw the trailer, and I was like, yes. <laughs> huh. uh, and I was the one who said, look. If you want to go for it, go for it. Yeah. Um, right before I said, you need a real job. You need a job with benefits. And <laughs> insurance. All of insurance. Insurance. I said all of that. Insurance from our ends. So, uh, and New York, here's what he's told me about. He just did a club in New York. He said, uh, and so New York, I imagine for theater as well as comedy, the toughest audiences in America. Yes, oh, yeah. no. A lot, a lot of arms crossed. Right. and like, what can you do for me? Right. Yeah. And so if you're doing theater in New York and it's going really, really well and you're by, you know, going from production to production to production, that's not the same as you know, community theater in Pleasantville, <laughs> USA. <laughs> exactly. Right? Now, did your mother, is your mother anything like the mother in the movie? Nothing at all. She's like the most supportive woman ever. Are you saying that because she might hear this interview? Hi, Mom. Love you. No, she really <laughs> yes. is. She really is. It was just much more um, interesting for the film for Mom to not love her career choices Roll and where ride. she's going. Well, exactly. parents worry. It's what they're going to do. I mean, right. my girl's in New York right now. My daughter's 25. She moved to New York. Oh, yeah? And she 
she wanted a career in musical theater. Oh. She's now working in retail. So, you know how it okay, goes. Totally. I'm just wondering, what did you do as you went from audition to audition to audition to audition? Were you able to sustain yourself just with acting? Yeah, I mean. That's great. Uh, yes, and I also work at a children's performing arts company in New York City. Cool. So that was a way to like, be creative. But, yeah, I mean, you have to have really thick skin. I think the both of us, we always say it's super hard to offend us. You have know? you done stand-up comedy? I've done improv, never stand-up. Because with yeah. improv... And acting and the work you're doing in a theater, uh, you could do it. Would it be lowering yourself now? No, not at all. I would love to do it. To be honest with you, I'm a little scared. You are scared? Yeah, I'm a okay. little. Bit, I'm not scared of. My, actually, I'm scared of a lot of things. I don't know. What I'm She's actually about. terrified I'm of terrified everything. Terrified of yeah. everything. Okay. Um, the most anxious person I've so, ever met. So you are a little like your character. In the <laughs> oh, movie. I'm a lot. There's a lot of barb in me. Okay, just good. Just like a few better clothing options. <laughs> Um, which one of you has better clothing options? I think, I would hope me. Barb's okay. not the greatest look right now. Okay, well, I hadn't seen enough. I okay. just saw the trailer, All so right, we'll, we'll look for that. Yeah. Uh, and and, and stand-up comedy, it, it is fascinating. How did you shoot this? Did you uh, did you go to, uh, you know, work at regular comedy clubs and, and work your way up? I, I haven't obviously seen the whole movie, and I don't want to spoil it. But. Yeah, we shot, um, we shot All in Manhattan, uh, 15 days, super short indie shoot, you know, a huge script in 15 days, so everybody was kind of like, how are you going to do that? But we shot at a comedy club, uh, uh, they use on Louie, um, so that was a great location for us. Um, you know, a lot of places around the city. New York is so great about letting people film. You know, uh, you know, as opposed to some other cities, it's like you pay them one flat fee of three hundred fifty dollars. You can have whatever you want for like an entire shooting period. No kidding. Yeah. And then you don't have to like you know spiff some people. Just well, you know, well, that, that depends on the location. <laughs> it's right. my impression yeah. of New York. I, I grew up there. Uh, oh, I, you did. We, yeah, two of us grew up East Coast. I was Connecticut. Okay. He, he was Baldwin. Okay. Uh, no, they're not saying that they're Tom Cruise sorry. from Vanilla Sky shutting down Times Square. Yeah. No, we, we, we didn't that. get to shut 300 down. Three hundred bucks, Times you Square. can shut down Times Square. <laughs> yeah. okay. Easy breezy. And then, and now here's the film, major city, yeah, premier, uh, a big film festival. Yeah. It's exciting, right? We're Very exciting. So exciting. You're doing television today. Uh, we are doing television to mm, yeah, tomorrow. Yeah, we got, we got some stuff on the books. I'm doing some gay press tomorrow. You know, <laughs> gotta get the word out, boys. <laughs> All right. Yeah, Jake's gay. If you couldn't tell. Yeah, shocker. <laughs> Um, you know, <laughs> I learned not to assume either, but yes. Right. Well, when we, we actually met in college because he had a crush on me. He had a huge crush. We met at a pimps and hoes party because I was in a frat, so, <laughs> so wait a minute. put wait that a in your pipe and smoke. <laughs> It's trying to confuse me now. So, wait a minute. You did have a crush on her? Or oh, yes. yeah. yeah before well, I, she was my type. He had a crush, and I'm giving quotation marks. Oh, right God. That kind of a crush. Yeah. Like a friend crush. No, no. A re- yeah, I was I mean, totally I thought I loved her. I, by the way, I have gay friends, and it took them a while to, to you know, yeah. that they played uh, all over the field. I have many gay boyfriends, so, Bob. Yeah, yeah. It's an actual thing that It's happens. an actual thing yeah. that I happens. had a gay boyfriend, too. Yeah. Yeah, we yeah. all have yeah. gay boyfriends. Yeah. I mean, I would sleep with Rihanna in a heartbeat. I mean, so let's not talk Well, just for the status, right? Exactly. Now, in the movie. So you have a preference. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. In the movie, Jake, you're a ballet dancer. With that, you're probably not in real life. Uh, don't know any ballet, right? Well, surprise, surprise. <laughs> oh, I do? was a dancer back in college. Nowadays, like, forget it. But what I kind mean, of, what kind of dance? Uh, musical you theater, do tap, you tap do, ballet, yeah, jazz, yeah, modern. Sure. Oh yeah. But uh, but we have uh, I have a body double. Spoiler alert! In the movie, who's in the ABT Ballet from New York? So we have some pretty fun. Same guy gags. did Mark Wahlberg in uh, that that the Dirk Diggler movie, right? That that body oh, double. Oh yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah, that's that's the end button. Stay for after the credits. <laughs> <laughs> so a body double because of the dance move, you wanted it to be like you were like, I'm not good enough for this. I want this body double to do that. Exactly. Okay. Like I can do a couple of things, but I mean, he like kicks his face, you know, or does like like yeah. 10 turns right. in a row. Right. It's like, that's not me. Now you said you, uh, you paid 350 bucks for a, you know, a license to shoot, but movies cost a lot. I mean, even independent films, you're getting into yes, the sir. hundreds of thousands, maybe millions of dollars. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Do you guys max out your credit cards, we, find uh, <laughs> investors. How do you get we, your cash? Yeah, it was all through private investors. Mm-hmm. Um, we had really readings kind of like you would for a theater show if you're looking to put it up mm-hmm. and uh, we were really lucky enough to have people who supported us and believed in us but it is not cheap to make a movie we learned that the hard way yeah it's really funny uh, you have to check it out uh, go on our website bobrivers.com we'll put up the trailer you must be joking world premiere tonight Aww. Uh, 7 o'clock, red carpet arrivals at 6.30. So anyone who wants to see you walk the red carpet can be there. Or afterwards, yeah. if they want to come up and say hi, we uh, want to meet everyone. Yeah, Are you going to say a few words? You're gonna yeah, do there's going to be a Q&A. Afterwards? Yes. Yep. Awesome. Yeah. See the stars, see the film, and then after that, is it playing in a wider release in the or in Seattle and at any theaters in the next uh, few weeks? It must be, right? Uh, no, as of now, it's just these two days, today and tomorrow. So, so this is come a out sneak. and get it. Who knows this when you'll sneak. see it next? All right. You must be joking. Sass and Jake, thank you very much. Thank Thank you. you so much.